Hi, I'm Mark Keefe with American Rifleman, and this week's gun of the week is a beautiful gun with a terrible name. This is the standard manufacturing number one case colored engraved. So that's a lot to swallow, but what we have is a traditional 1911 that really aesthetically is unlike anything that we've seen in a long time, except perhaps out of the Colt Custom Shop. This gun is a 1911 that is made from 4140 steel forgings, and then it is case colored. This isn't a chemical finish. This is genuine bone charcoal case coloring where they put the parts in an oven with like literally animal bones. But that's how you get this rich, beautiful finish. And that finish is applied to the frame, to the mainspring housing, the grip safety, the slide. It's absolutely beautiful. And the parts that aren't case colored are either stainless like the barrel or they're a rich niter or fire blue. When you look at the screws here, when you look at your slide stop, I mean, these are really beautiful parts. The thing about standard manufacturing is, it's really the same people that do Connecticut shotgun manufacturing. They make Parkers, they make Winchester Model 21s, they make a lot of high-end shotguns, but frankly, not everybody wants a high-end shotgun. So now they've gotten into things like the 1911 pistol. And frankly, this is just a beautiful gun. It has double diamond, of course, wooden stocks. Again, it's got the, the niter blued screws. It has a flat mainspring housing. You have actually very well executed checkering here on the front strap. This is a company that starts with forgings, CNC machines them, and then finishes them beautifully. Sights, of course, are worn tactical, but you also have these aesthetic touches here. Just about every part that can be engraved is, and these are the same people that decorate Parkers. So they are very, very good at this. In terms of being a very good pistol for the range or for self-defense, you have a lowered and flared ejection port. You have a beaver tail grip safety that no way that hammer, which is a commander style, is gonna come back and bite you. And really, this is just a very well executed gun. Now it's priced at about $1,800, so it's not inexpensive but find a 1911 that looks like this for that amount of money. For more on Gun of the Week, go to AmericanRifleman.org. And for more on guns like the standard manufacturing engraved, go to stdgun.com.